After a months long search and added weeks of debates and meetings, Luzerne County government finally has a new top manager. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Madonna Mantillon went to tonight's county council meeting and has more about the new person in charge. Applause rang out inside the Luzerne County Courthouse as Randy Robertson was named county manager. Mr. Irvin? Yes. Yes. Nine out of 11 county council members voted to hire the Kentucky native at a council meeting Tuesday night. Council member Chris Perry voted no and Tim McGinley abstained, but a majority was reached, making it official. There was a lot of polarization on council in the past, um, a lot of debates going on who should be the next county manager. So I'm just happy that we appointed somebody. This long awaited decision comes exactly three weeks after none of the three finalists, including Robertson, were able to secure the seven council votes needed to get the job. Now, now his appointment concludes months of uncertainty over who will lead the county full time. This was one of the most important, if not the most important decision council will make, you know, in the coming months and the past couple months. So, you know, we wish him the best. It's definitely a difficult job. He will definitely have his hands full, um, but we're happy to have him in Lisbon County. Tom Dombrowski is one of the residents who has been following every twist and turn in this process. He is glad to see it come to an end. I think everybody sort of came together for the good of the county, and for all 324,000 people, I think it was. The right thing to do. Yeah. Greg Brandon has high expectations and looks forward to the future. I hope very much that he is the county manager that this county has needed since they adopted home rule. And uh, I just, that's really all I have to say about it. I hope that he's the change agent we need. In Wilkes Barre, Madonna Mantione, 2822 Eyewitness News. Randy Robertson was not present at tonight's council meeting. His first day on the job is expected to be on June 1st.